two clock shares of cups. I am Dash. And I'm Cash. And uh, Dash is back at school online right now. Uh, but we are excited to be doing a King of Cards. Uh, we've had some really... We've had some really great openings lately for King of Cards. Really great battles. Uh, I was the king. Uh, as you see, this this battle will have guilds of Ravnica, Mystery Booster, and Battle Bond. So it'll be a good one, hopefully. Um, the last couple have been really close. I was king for three times. Almost came back in the last one. Fell just short. First time we had the advantage come into play. Yeah, so, just like uh, five cents or something. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. It came into play. It made the difference. So. Yeah. Um, anyway, so that was a real thing, and uh, so anyways, I hope uh, you guys enjoy this, hopefully we pull some good stuff. Um, we're going to open up uh, a few other cards before we get into this, and good luck. This is Devin versus Steve. Devin will have a 50 cent advantage to start. Alright, so to start, we're going to go through a few cards I just got in the mail that I was very excited about. So, um, this was actually from Atlas Games in, uh, oh, so in Kitchener, Ontario. Really nice. So this is... I've really fell in love with these lands. I didn't actually see them when they came out. Um, and uh, I just noticed them recently. This is just from a couple of years ago, 2018. Um, and this was from the Ravnica Weekend uh, promo packs. So uh, really, really cool. Um, so that was one of them. Uh, the next one I got here is a, I believe this is a revised land. Oh, that's nice. Nice old school mountain. It's not in bad shape. You can see there's a, definitely when you look at it on an angle, it definitely has some age to it. Yeah. Um, and the backs, it's probably a, maybe a, maybe an MP, maybe a, a mid play. Uh, Another this one mountain. they call a, they call that light play. I don't know. It's not bad. Um, got a nether mountain. So I've just That's been kind of so trying to get a set of these. Long. This is in better shape than the last one, though you can see it's definitely been played. Um, yeah. anyways, I just thought I'd share some of these with you. I'll, you know, you know, I'll take them off camera here. And we'll do sort of. Why don't I turn them over so let's keep keep Dash surprised here? So this is again. This is an island. This is a nice old school island, and this is actually in pretty good shape. This is probably the best the best shape of the three so far. Um, next one I got here, Dash. Next one I got here is a card. It was just a common called Flickering Ward. Um, just a card. I I love these these wards in this uh, that you can bring them back to your hand. But it gives a creature you control protection from the chosen color, and then you can return it to your hand. So if the oh, board gets blown up, kind you can... Kind of like Ranker. Uh, Ranker comes back to your hand automatically. This one you got to pay for. So this one's actually... Propaganda! A, propaganda. So this one is... Uh, each turn, each can uh, each creature cannot attack you unless their controller pays two for that creature. Love those tax effects. So I wanted that. It wasn't too bad for price. I think it was the last one they had. Uh, Another I've been, port colors. Yeah, I've been collecting these. Like 50 port colors. Well, uh, probably 30, but this one's in pretty nice shape. Again, probably uh, maybe a, a mid play Why to do LP. Why 50 port colors? Because uh, it's a card I think might go up, so I, I figured I'd Ooh. hold on to them. So this was a judges, a judges one. Uh, this was a, a judges card. It's, it's, a, it's a fancy version. Um, anyways, I just thought this was a fun card. It wasn't very expensive. Uh, really nice uh, bird. Uh, again, it got a... Friday Night Magic promo Watch, Watch Wolf. Wolf? Uh, I thought with the wolves in the new set coming up, I saw this. I thought, eh, why not? And that looks like it's going to be. And it looks like a great card. Ooh! This is probably the this is probably the most uh, expensive of all the cards. This was a swamp. This is an arena swamp. So this is from nineteen ninety six. And it's in pristine condition. It is in really nice condition. So. Uh, definitely, uh, definitely an LP on this one. I, I found their grading spin. Uh, this is a card I wanted for a deck, which I didn't own. So this one's actually interesting. If you guys haven't played this card before, it costs three. It's got Defender on it. When it comes into play with a 1-1 one, one counter on it, so it's a 2-2 two, two when it comes into play, the beginning of each player's upkeep, that player draws a card for each 1-1 one, one counter on Walking Archive, and you can pay to put counters on them. Okay. So just in a in a counter deck, uh, he's really neat. Uh, he is also in, in a couple of decks that I do shenanigans with. Uh, he works out pretty well. And this was Lergoy. a deck master, Lurgoff, uh, foil. Just love the old school. Uh, always fun to play Lurgoff. That's so cool. And it's a it's back from deck master. So that is in the old old set. So all right, I'm going first. I don't know what you're doing. I already opened it. Well, you're second. You are the king. You are. Leave the cards upside down. You can't look yet. No cheating. So, uh, so first up, I am challenging. I'm just taking the token off. No, leave the token. Leave everything, please. You are second. Be patient. All right. 
So this challenge is King Steve versus Devin. I am opening for DJ Devin. DJ Devin! All right, so. Leapfrog. Leapfrog, gotta like that salamandery dude. All right. Sworn Companions. Pax Favor. The last couple of these were really interesting. I mean, I was king. I, I came back great right on the one. Uh, the other one I thought I'd come back, and I, however, failed. Just too short. Just $3. Pulled $15. The, the, the one pack, the last pack I pulled was like $60 worth of cards. Uh, $60? About, yeah. The last one, this one's nice. Chemistry's Insights. Nice draw, nice draw card. Get to do it twice. Uh, Ledev Champion. Not bad. Might be worth something. Elf Knight. Should you watch Sphinx? And what do we got? Narcomoeba. Whenever it's put into your graveyard from your library, uh, you may put it on the battlefield. Uh, <laughs> he's still a 1-1. One, one. Woohoo! You get to put a 1-1 one, one on the battlefield. Not going to do too much for us. All right, take your time. i got to see the cards, because if I've got to price them, right? For the... for the Lock thing. it. All right. Mist. Pause for reflection. Well, you got your own champions. If they're worth anything, you just cancel each other out. All right, Colossus. I know that's worth something. Mythic. Okay. Oh, Mythic. Aurelia, Exemplar of Justice. Hmm. Uh, I guess it's maybe a couple bucks. I don't think it's worth that much. It's a nice angel, though. Angels are going to be a thing in this upcoming set, so foil common. So we might see Aurelia go up a little bit. I this is it. a really cool foil. It is cool looking. That's so intriguing. All right, so... Guessing so far that the king has gained value on us because I didn't see anything worth much in my and, and I got and, a mythic in Devin's first pack. So, all right, come on, Devin, I'm gonna do this for you, buddy. All right, so we started with an uncommon Sky Marcher Aspirant. These are so odd. How like they do uncommon, uncommon. Gift of Estates has nice value to it too. So that's I think it's a couple bucks. Could be wrong. Could be. Could be more. Could be a little less. But it's uh, that's definitely got value. We're catching up here, buddy. First two cards. That's the thing with mystery boosters. You never know. Oh, tutelage. I think that's worth. Oh, the Sphinx's is tutelage. I don't know. If, I don't know what it's worth. All right. Or something. Crow of tidings. Cartage of zeal. Pyro helix. Okay, we're going. We're going south here. Come on. Come on. Snake umbra. umbra. The, all the umbras are good. They are. River hoopo. So, nice looking bird. Uh, you gain li you gain two life and you draw a card. Oh, I like that card. could use that card. All right. A messy tomb. Draw two cards and then discard a card. Eh, it's not very good. I doubt that's worth anything. Crenellated wall. That's not going to be worth anything. Okay. What do we got here? Whelming wave. Return all creatures to their owner's hands except for Krakens, Leviathans. Oh, where have you been all my life? This is like perfect for, an, for my uh, Kraken deck. And what do you got here? Fungasaur. I think we've pulled that already. We have. It's nice. All right. So we didn't pull a huge value, but I think we definitely pulled... I think I'm going to pull something right, I, I'm guessing five, ten, five, ten dollars worth of cards there. Uh, one of those cards actually could be worth more. I'm, I just can't keep track of everything. So many cards in this set. Cloud Shift. Soul Warden. Thrumming Bird. Okay. So that's an uncommon. Mystical Teachings. Bye that one. is a, hold on, that's a, I know it's expensive, I guess, but it is a, uh, a tutor. It might have some value to it. Balagged Scorpion, Mind Rake. Okay. Goblin Motivator. He's not pulling the uncommon so far. Impact trem Tremors. Tremors. Wild Growth. Nice, nice reprint. Rose Thorn Halberd. Didn't need to be in this. Merciel Geist. Mercurial. Geist. Coom Refuge. Okay, not worth anything. Dictator Ooh, that, Lewis. however, is. That is a nice card. The lead has been extended, I believe, with that. By so much. Dictator, and that's such a creepy art. Ooh, Alesha. and Alesha. Oh, and his Amoro oh! Foil. Alright, not looking good for you, uh, Devin, so far. Uh, maybe I can pull you something big in Battle Bond here. Thought maybe we had a little maybe bit of a he'll comeback there, but as things stand right now, I believe I believe we have a reigning champion who's going to last for another turn. But we will see. Ooh. I get to flip. 
All right. I'm going to open yours, and I'm going to flip the cards around, okay, at the same time while you're doing that. we just flipping the rares to the back, not flipping the good cards out of this. I'm watching you. Hey. <laughs> All right. I'll put the zombie token on the front. All right. Something I good here. I fully flipped it. You got pen all over you, buddy. Hmm? You got pen all over your hand. I don't know, rub it on your white shirt. All right. Liturgy of Blood. Destroy target creature. Add three. Painful Lesson. Like this card. Using it in a deck. Rebuke. Wandering Wolf. Azra. Spellweaver Duel. Canopy Spider. Cowl Prowler. Stone Golem. All right, so I think if we got a land tax that Dash would have reacted and we would have found out ahead of time. So we didn't get a land tax, I'm pretty sure. Mm -hmm. All right. Thrasher Brute. Angel of Retribution, not big dollars. And ooh, Mystical Confluence. Uh, you choose three. You may choose the same mode more than once. Counter target spell, unless the controller pays three. Return target creature to its owner's hand and draw a card. That's a pretty nice, that's a pretty nice rare. Forest. I don't think it's going to be enough, though. I think, mm -hmm. think you're in trouble, buddy. All right. Rocks, fruit, raptor companion, fill with fright, pacifism. Love the pacifism. Centaur healer, thunder strike, scrawny cat. Scrawny cat. Charging binox, call to heal, peace strider, switcheroo. I'll put those down. And change, exchange control of two target creatures. That's fun. Love those kind of cards. Pulse of Morassa. Okay. Spectral Searchlight. And? Stunning Reversal Mythic! The next time you would lose the game this turn, instead draw seven cards and your life total becomes one. Exile Stunning Reversal. That's awesome, eh? Wow. So... Um, we're going to total things up. I, I believe we would. have a reigning champion who will be For back sure. again. Uh, we will... Uh, wow. Cut two Mythics two. and a Dictate of Erebos. Right. Uh, and as well as Izumuro here and Aless just smiles to death. So, yeah, we'll total things up. Uh, good luck. And I think I won. <laughs> and we think, that, we think that Steve won, right? Yeah. All right. So the results are in. And as it was feared, I have let you down terribly, Devin. King Steve has won. Uh, he won thoroughly, and it was an, a rear-end kicking. Uh, you lost by about ten, eleven dollars. Uh, yeah, yeah, it was. Uh, there's some pretty good cards. That that uh, dictate was worth about fifteen dollars. So that's. Uh, it's, uh, that's I knew it was worth something. Yeah, that what was the foil is Maru. Uh, a few bucks. So. Not bad. Um, anyways, uh, was a good battle. Like, like, it's nice to see good cards. Uh, nothing worse than when we do these when it's like $3 versus $2. So we spend like $40 on packs and we get $3 worth. Uh, so good value. Third time in a row, we actually got really nice value for, uh, for the opening. So do hope you enjoyed it. Uh, next up is, uh, next up is who? Who do I have up next? No. Uh, Why are you, stop. You're just guessing. Uh, next up, I believe is Dave. Uh, I'll Dave double check. The chemist. I'll double check. There's a couple people up, so uh, it's either Dave or it's not Dave. So he's one of the next two anyway. Dave Olson, Dave the chemist. Oh my goodness! All right, so uh, good luck. Uh, I hope you enjoy the cards. Uh, there's some good stuff here. You are you're just accumulating wealth right now, Pierre. Uh, you sorry, who won? Boil oh my god, who this one? Steve, we're saying all kinds of names. I'm getting all confused. Steve, you have you're accumulating wealth here. <laughs> it's usually just me who accumulates wealth. So, uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, lots of uh, Kaldheim stuff coming up. Uh, I hope uh, everyone have a magical day. Bye. Thank you for watching Collectors of the Coast. Please subscribe and like below. If you like our content, please consider becoming a patron. Uh, patrons help us grow the channel, uh, and we, uh, I'll get great deals and more. Uh, check us out on Discord if you'd like to become a part of the community. The information to join the Discord is in the description below.